can let someone else in. Oh, yeah. I've just got, that's the crack up there, so that only extends up to about that point, so that's pretty good. That's your other crack through there and into the bridge area. So, that looks pretty good. And importantly, there's no pelvic fractures. That all looks good. Long bones are all good. Shoulders are good. No fractures through there. Front legs are good. So and good mobility. So I didn't yeah, know. yeah. So really, what we need to do is just fix that bridge fracture and stabilise that little one at the front there. And um, she should be fine. Well, that is good news. Yeah. Is there any reason why you think that it would, the bubbly blood is coming from... Well, what, what we need to do is I'm going to anaesthetise. I'm not, I'm not going to do that today. What we do is put on some pain with antibiotics for a couple of days. Yeah. Um, make sure that there's no infection in the, the shells, um, the fractures in the shell. Um, I've got to anaesthetise it to fix the fracture because what we're actually going to do is um, make a little gutter along where that fracture is and seal that with the dental acrylic. Seen the video I've got of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah. watching that last time. Yeah, yeah well, that, this sort of fracture is perfect for that. Um, but this one here, what we need to do is put a little bit of wire across that um, fracture to stabilise that. But to do all that, we've got an anaesthetiser. So what um, we'll do is an anaesthetiser and we'll go down the throat. Injection in this trail? No, no. With these guys, um, basically they've got a vein that runs down the side of their neck, the jugular vein. And okay. um, we're actually quite easy to anaesthetise, so nice. we give a bit of that. And, um, Open up, but I'm going to open a mouth and tube down there anyway for her to breathe. And um, we'll get a good She also has one eye sort of damage with that. Yeah, she's got, um, doesn't look like there's any um, skull fracture there, which is good. Both eye sockets look all normal. So I think she's had, yeah, and that's the other possibility where the blood's coming from, is she's just had a knock to the head as well. Yeah, yeah and the, yeah, that, that, you can see where her head there compared to that mm -hmm. shell fracture. So she's obviously had something hit. That front end, and so hopefully it's just knocked that. Um, and, um, she, you know, she's alert enough. She's coming out of a shell. Yeah, shape. yeah. But she's sort of indicates she hasn't got any sort of significant brain damage. So, uh, so yeah, she's got a, certainly better than average chance of survival there. So, but um, yeah, we start on some antibiotics. We'll bandage her up, you know, give her a clean up in a sec, and some pain relief, and we'll probably keep that going until the end of the week. And then all's down the line, we'll get popping around until the end of the week. Excellent. No worries. So, and then. Um, yeah. She, she, if we'd left her in the wild, she probably would have recovered. Oh, uh, she, yeah, look, these guys are pretty tough. They potentially can. But um, certainly, us doing what we're going to do is going to speed up recovery. So, the risk is um, an infection, yeah. obviously. Yeah. Have you got the details where she was picked up? Yeah, ma'am, Yeah. But so, they're not native to that area. Yeah, no, so, um, and, um, yeah, we've got a few different release points that they can go to. Um, Excellent. Yeah, so, so we're going to give the injury up and give her a clean up and see what we get. Fantastic. On the bridge, and there's a little crack there on the side, and that's just a little bit moody. One eye shot, possibly because of the head injury, and hopefully that's the only reason that the blood keeps on coming from the mouth. But anyway, Shane's going to give her a wash now. So. Someone's gone straight over the top of this thing. Yeah, they? speed up. Okay. Nothing like she's got any breaks or anything in the jaw, in the beak there. So. Oh, it happens. It happens and closes his mouth. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. In fact, we might even be able to get a good look at that. Head out. Don't stress it too much. Looks like you know, it's, she's probably just, I don't know if you can see it in the camera there, but she's got a little crack in the roof of her mouth. That's where the blood's coming from, I think. So That should heal up. That should heal. Yeah, yeah that's where it's coming from. Uh, Lovely. So I think she's got a bit of a headache. But, yeah, no fracture to the jaw there. See the line I kind of, on the roof of her mouth? It's a bit hard to see. She's got her tongue in the way now. Yeah. 
There's a line at the top of the mouth there. A little blood line. Yeah, I think I got it there. And she's yeah, just taking it. Mm. But it's not very displaced and it looks pretty good so So that's not really gonna affect it, so that should be good so face a bit of cleaner. So a bit better than bruised but She's got, she's got a good chance. She has got a good chance. Let's pack this room into a bit of flamazine. So I'll just bandage her up and basically we'll change that daily. The next couple of days just till we lift all the dirt and rubbish out of there. Yeah, good bandage. Have the back legs not going to No, back legs will be fine. And we'll just give it some pain relief. And some antibiotic. Oh. What did you use there? Just a, uh, a bit of plastic? That's actually the corner of an x-ray field. Oh, okay. So I just find it's perfect. For yeah, mm. flexibility and thickness. Do you use this for anything else? No, no. Just for yeah, we've got, I've got all my old x-rays that we took and I've gone through and cut all the corners off. Because <laughs> so, with the digital x-ray, we don't have film anymore. Okay, yeah. So I've gone through and do that. Because I send people home with turtles, they've got to force feed them, they've got to open their mouth. So I send them home with a pack with one of those and a couple of syringes. Nice. And they can open their mouth, put the food down there that way. Very so, good. Uh, but yeah, I find credit cards work, but they're a little bit thick. And guitar plectrums are really good too. Uh, but yeah, um, x-ray film does the job. Lovely. All right. So, leave it with me. We'll go after the next couple of days. Yeah, I'll, 